Welcome in everybody. I'm Ryan from Bim Bam Gaming. And we're going to start Alan Wake 2. Alan Wake 2. You know, I should have looked up where Alan Wake 2 lies in the universe of things. I don't know. I don't know, like in the universe of, I guess, Alan Wake or whatever the universe is of these stories, but because I want to play, I want to play Control as well. Let me look it up. Hello. Hmm. Huh. Okay. I don't think it matters. I, you didn't even know I finished Alan Wake? I didn't. Shh. I didn't. That's the thing. I didn't finish Alan Wake. But I got so... Ah, uh, what's, what's the word? So... Stressed by the first Alan Wake that I'm just, I think I'm just gonna say that I, I finished it. You know, I think my, I don't think my heart can take finishing the first Alan Wake. <laughs> Jenny G, that's me. Thank you for the tier one sub, your sixth month. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Hopefully you guys are okay with the fact that I have not finished Alan Wake because it was a lot. It was a lot. And I really want to play the new one that just came out like not that long ago. And maybe it'll be like really good or maybe it'll be just as bad and we'll end up not finishing it and we'll just go straight to control. But we don't know. Okay. Relax game. Relax. Okay, we won't know until we try, right? The Backrooms game, we were playing with Christian. Uh, were we gonna finish it? Oh, we are gonna finish it whenever Christian wants to join us. Like, he's doing other stuff right now, but he said he might join us later, and if he does, we'll switch over to that and continue the Backrooms game. So, have no fear. That will happen. I don't know if it'll be tonight or tomorrow or when, but it will happen because I want to finish it. You love control? Yeah, me too. Control's so good. It is so good. It's different. It's like, it's like sci-fi, dark. Um, I wouldn't say it's like jump out at you scary, but it's, I don't know. It's very cool. It's very cool. What game is this? Trey. What game is this? What do you think? What do you think? Mm hmm, yeah. We're gonna be doing Alan Wake 2. <laughs> Let me set our goal for TikTok and then we'll start the cutscene. You didn't even know there was a second one? Yeah. It, it is Roblox. Roblox decided to make Alan Wake 2. How did you know? Roblox is an amazing place, isn't it? Amazing. Let's do... I don't know why. We're going to do email messages. Email messages. That's going to be our goal. Wow! Okay, so there is... I kn <sighs> Okay. There is nudity in this game.
Is there a sensor option? I know you guys don't mind. It's it's mainly it's for TikTok. I just want to make sure I don't accidentally show something on the screen cuz I don't know when it's going to happen. Unless you guys know when it's going to happen, I don't want to accidentally show something that I shouldn't show. Okay, subtitles are on. Oh, there is. Boom! Boom! All right. Now we don't have to worry about it. Now I don't have to worry. I can just play and I don't need to worry about it. All right. You can tell me you got five minutes into the first one and couldn't finish playing it. It scared you too much. Wait, of this one? Wait, of the first one, Alan Wake? The first one was really hard. I don't know if this one's gonna be as hard, but... But now we don't have to worry about um, censoring anything. And I know I apologize to you guys because uh, normally you guys are the place where we don't censor, but also I don't want to show something I shouldn't show. And then all of a sudden TikTok's like, bam, you're gone. <laughs> so no, I'll be, I'll be on, I'll be on TikTok here in a moment, here in a moment. Is it scary, scary? Um, I don't know. I've never played this. So let's start and let's let's go. Let's get through the first cutscene and then I'll bring TikTok into it. Sound good? Hopefully it's not too bright. I did turn the brightness like all the way up. Really, I turned it like all the way up. Maybe I turned it too up. I don't know what this gamma means, but I just know for some reason it's like, we'll do it like this. This should be good. If I need to change it to the other ones, then I will, but this should be a good kind of balance. All right, let's start the cutscene. Oh, let me use my controller. Um, normal. Can you imagine nightmare? Excuse me, what? Excuse me, what? Does that mean something? Hearts for Ansley? What does that mean? <laughs> Excuse me. What? <laughs> Is that like a St. Patrick's Day thing? I don't understand. <laughs> I don't understand. You don't know what it means? Okay. Okay. It's so weird. <laughs> okay. Wait, hold on a second. I gotta get up for a second and then we'll start. And then we'll start. <laughs>
All right. Here we go. Story would make it less stressful. Yeah, but I want it to be like a little bit combat. I just don't want it to like be impossible. You know, there should be a balance. Like, I feel like what we were playing before was hard mode. And it shouldn't have been. <laughs> Should have just been like, I, I chose regular, but it felt like hard mode. You're gonna say maybe three or four? Oh gosh. Oh gosh. That's, that's too many. It's too many. All right, let's try this. Get your popcorn. Dude, nightmare, it's locked. Good. Back to the beginning. We all come to a story with hopes and expectations, looking for an answer. Sometimes it would be better to live with that hope without ever knowing the full story. It looks so real, is that real? His face looked so real. In a horror story, there are only victims and monsters. And the trick is not to end up as either. But trapped by the genre, we are all ripped to pieces along the way. This is not the story I hoped it would be. This is not the ending I wanted. Well, that's water. This story will eat us alive. This story is a monster. And monsters wear many faces. Yes! I love this already. are insane. Oh. That's me. Okay, these graphics are absolutely insane. Insane. This looks so freaking good and i don't even have it on the highest quality of graphics and this is how good it looks like this is crazy and yeah thank goodness for the nudity sensor am i right because i have a feeling that this what we're seeing now wouldn't have been covered up that's my guess i don't know for sure but all right let's get tiktok in here and let's get rolling yeah <laughs> Is this Alan's lawyer friend? What was his name? Was it Stucky? Was that his lawyer? It wasn't like a lawyer. He, lawyer. he was like a per, or like an agent or something, right? Stucky, I think. All right, TikTok is up. If you are waiting, it is here. Welcome in. Wow. Okay. We're here. We're here. Dang, this looks good. Hello, Ehab. Hello, Trey. Oh my gosh. Hi, guys. Look at me. Guys, look how good. Look at this. Can I run? Why am I here? Oh, those are headlights. Wait, do we, can they see me? Oh, where did he go? I think I need help. I look like I could use assistance. You guys. You waited four hours to tell you hi, thank you. Well, I mean, I guess thank you. Um, hi. 
I'm so glad you you're here to tell me hi. All right, if you guys are just joining us, this is Alan Wake 2. And dang, can I just say the graphics look incredible. Absolutely incredible. So if you're joining us now, you're joining at the right time because it just started. It, it, oh my God! Oh! Awesome. No, this is good. Yeah, you're here early. Welcome. You're here for all the scary stuff. Let's let's get to 69k likes. I can sprint. Okay. Yeah, I should sprint. I should sprint. This place doesn't feel safe. This place doesn't feel safe. Oh! Oh! No! Okay, no, we're fine. We're fine. Just keep going. Just keep going, you guys. We're okay. We're cool, we're cool. Are you guys chill? Are you chill? <gasps> What do I do? Ah! Not chill. Not chill. Opposite of chill. That escalated extremely quickly. Typical Sunday fun day. That's right. That's right. I had my hand on the I had my hand on the trigger, you guys. I was ready. I was ready. But also, uh, what was that sound? Um, I feel like I heard a ah. That's what it was. That's what it was. Lilibeth, and thank you for this sub, and welcome to the family. And welcome, you guys, to Alan Wake 2. Alan Wake 2. I have, I have my hand on the trigger for this. I'm ready. I'm ready. Hey, kiddo. How are you? Oh, yeah, we just skipped a two. Good, I, one was too much stress. This trip might We're gonna pretend like we know what thought. happened. I'm sorry I've been gone so much lately, Logan. Oh my god, Mom, it's not your fault. People get all murdery. Anyone got, uh, cliff notes? Just work stuff. Right. Well, Dad and I are just watching the latest episode of Night Springs here. Mom, it's so good. No spoilers! Who are these people? I'll let you get back to the show. You were supposed to wait and watch with me. I love you both. This is what happens when you go on work trips, Mom. Love Not you. wrong. And say hi to Casey. Tell him to stop brooding so much. Logan? Who? I will. Who's who's I Logan? Can. Who are these people? Logan thinks you should try cheering up. <laughs> Snarky kid. Wonder where she gets that from. 
They're both drinking their coffee at the same time. That's weird. Is that weird? That feels weird. It can't be a coincidence that another feels kind of strange. body turns up just as we arrive in town. Feels like the killer's leaving us a message. Hmm. I'm glad you're on this case with me, Anderson. It's right up your alley. He looks kind of suspicious, think of me, right? Think of me as the backup. This is the beginning. This is the beginning. Okay. If you're here, you're on time. Any words of advice? Nothing that would cheer anyone up. Why is he so creepy? All right. Here we are. Debbie Cold Downer. Lake. Time to get to work. Kimberly Queen, thank you for the tier one sub. Your second month. Thank you. The name of the game is Alan Wake 2. If you're here, you're right on time because we just started. To be here to show us to the crime scene. We just started. There's the car. So where's the deputy? <laughs> Eaten by a bear. I'll check out that map. Return. Invitation. Return one. Wait, what is return one? Okay, get to the Those scene of the event. Find the deputies. By the trees. All right, we got a map. How do I see my map? I think I hear someone. Where are we? We're over there. Well, I don't know where the scene of the event is. Eaten by a bear. Layla! Glist! Glist! All right, you guys, get your Dr. Peppers. We're ready. We're starting Alan Wake 2. If you're here, you're here right on time. Right on time. Our current like goal is 69K likes. And we're about to open up a fresh one. Yes! You got a, a one liter Dr. Pepper going hard tonight, huh? That's right. You love Dr. Pepper? Me too. Me too. <laughs> hey, over here. You got the Dr. Pepper peeves? Nice. Yeah, I tried them. I thought they were, um, well, no, I'm, let you hey, eat them. Eat, eat them before I tell you right? what I think. Sheriff Breaker said you'd be coming by to take over the case. You're half right. Anderson. Oh, me? Oh, am I Anderson? Anderson? I'll be leading this case. Sorry. Seems Sorry. you already know my partner, Alex Casey. Shoot. Sorry about that, ma'am. I'm Deputy Mulligan. I just figured that, you know, that, uh... I can hear them. right here, Thornton. My partner, Thornton. <laughs> Gosh. That crime scene. He's not what you call the sharpest axe in the shed. Right here? What do you mean? Are they with you? Oh, shit. They didn't hear me, did they? Uh, yeah, we did. Hmm. Any witnesses? Were there any witnesses? Yeah. A couple of out-of-towners. Jay, thank things. you for the Around email the message. Enough. Not that we have anything against city folk, right, Thornton? But don't is worry. He, is he calling Sheriff us suspicious? Took him back to town a while ago. All right, let's take a look. I want to see the body. How do we get there? Oh, sure, that's real simple. Just through the hole in the fence, down the hill towards the lake, around the old convenience store. You can't miss it. Everything's been closed since the area was fenced off. The store, the campground, okay. all of it. If you can move. Tell him I'm here, wait. Uh, they got it, Thornton. My goodness. All right, down to the convenience store. Before we get to the crime scene, there's time to review the facts of the case so far. Make sure I'm seeing the clues clearly. He does kind of sound like Joe from Family Guy. Okay, I can access the case board inside the mind place. The mind place. My version of the mind palace technique. To sift through clues and work the case. 
Building the mind place again for each case. Using each field office as a model in my head. The That's cool. Board. That's cool. All right. Thanks, you, Genevieve, for sharing the live so many times. Thank you. Everything we know about the previous murders. Worth taking another look. What? I can move around. Okay. I can zoom in and out. All right. Move the cursor. I'm now free to navigate the case board or leave by pressing B. All right. All right. What do we know here? The previous unalivings. The method. Slight differences in unalivings, bloating only, commonality in bodies, but not the cause of unaliving, chest trauma, exposure to water, post unaliving. Okay. All right. Uh, profile. Tattooing on the person. The unaliver targets. The unalive targets have no discernible common traits. Chest trauma resembles animal um, hunting, I guess. Okay, people. All the people reported missing in 2010. No other commonalities. Okay, so basically, nothing has anything to do with each other except for the chest thing, right? That's the only thing that anything has in common with anybody is some sort of chest wound. That's it. Jay, thank you for sharing the live so many times. Thank you. I can see you guys. Thank you guys so much. All right, we got our map. We're in the mind place. Can I take the flashlight with me out of the mind place? That doesn't make sense. Why would I? Oh, and the tattoos. Yeah, the tattoos. I guess that happens after. All right, well. I see you're already hard at work, Anderson. Oh, oh. Close to cracking it. We're just yeah. getting started. Let's head down the hill to the crime scene. Let's go. The, visiting the mind place. What did it say? Hey, Casey. You does not pause the game. Why now? Look, Anderson, you're a That's good to know. detective than I am. You've cracked cases that had the rest of us baffled. I don't want to slow you down. Are you thinking of retiring? Are they collecting parts? You know what happens to cops who say this is their last case. Mm-hmm. Real funny, Anderson. I don't think I like our partner. I don't know what you guys think. Stairs are out. You okay to jump He's down? He's kind of strange. I'm not that old. You're late again? No, you're not late at all. We just started. This is Alan Wake 2. Alan Wake 2. <laughs> We just got to the crime scene. We have not learned anything. So you're right on time. And the graphics look incredible. Think he's just old school? Fucking nature. He's like my age yeah, though. Like, like my character's age, you know? Die. Like we're like the same age. He's not like old. It's not like he's been around working the field longer than me. All right, I'm gonna pass you. Oh, you're not gonna let me not pass a bad you? Place okay. To get murdered. Hmm. If getting back to nature is your thing. If getting back to nature is your thing. Damn. Should have brought an umbrella. I like the rain. The only thing around here that feels like home. You think the local law had the sense to put up a tarp? Does he like did, to have conflict with everything? I feel like he's got a comeback to literally everything I'm saying. Hey! Deputy Thornton, I take it. That's me, at your service, ready to get this case solved. Now the body's behind the store. Come on, I'll show you. She trips over everything, but I can fix her. That was me, I didn't realize I was pressing this oh. button. I was making yeah, her trip. Are, huh? She's That's super so cute cool. though, I love her. Hunting down psycho serial killers and shootouts with the mob. You forgot the UFO. Oh, this is the guy who doesn't have a filter. What? Those are real? You guys hiring? <laughs> Let's just see this is this like a dodge? Now 
Now this is the scene of the crime. The other the guy. On the table. Wait. So he didn't touch nothing, you know. Proceed. Wait, what? Stuff. The other guy at the fence. No tarp. You owe me a coffee. Okay. Let's start by examining our guest of honor. Oh, this is the this guy I was in the, the beginning. The previous murders. One, two, step. <laughs> Step one. Haliva, thank you for the email message. Now I have that in my head. Body is positioned on the table. Could y'all imagine when before I started this game on Twitch and YouTube, there is a a sensor setting. And if I didn't set that. Y'all. I don't even want to think about it. You unlocked your first key image. You can find, you can place it on the case board inside the mine place, okay? Okay, oh wait, is this the image? Or am I gonna place it? Turns up just as we arrive in town. She looks so familiar, is she an actress? Is she someone real, like in, in real life? Her face looks very familiar. Kay Graham? Is that her name? She looks like an actress from Vampire Diaries, like the, the witch, Cat. Are you talking about the witch that was in Vampire Diaries? All characters made her from real people? Oh. Bonnie? I don't think she looks like Bonnie to me. Okay. This is my picture. Another body has been found in the woods near Bright Falls. Perfect timing. Need to see if it's linked to the unalivings here to investigate. When a key image is placed, it will prompt a new question. Objectives are viewable at the case board and your goals. What are our goals? You are now free to examine the case board. Goals, investigate. Okay, excellent. So I can't see her face now. I can all, okay, can I see it if I go to the case board? No, it let me see her face for a second and now I can't. Let me see your face. Now we're never going to know. Now we're never going to know. <laughs> Not the Vampire Diaries girl. Okay. Definitely Cat Graham. Who's Cat Graham? The name sounds familiar. You can collect clues and progress the investigation. Bruising collect. on the wrist from the cargo straps holding him down. Nautica, thank you for the sub. Welcome to the family. You Googled that they're real people? I believe it. She looks really familiar. I just don't know what I know her from. The killer left the heart right next to the body. Inside stab wound, chest cut open, heart removed. They took it out, but they left it, so. Okay, let's put these on the case board. <laughs> this is crazy. Newly discovered clues can be placed onto the open question. How? How do I place? How? Oh, here. No. Click on the cauldron? What? I have all these pictures. Put the pictures out. I can't pick them. I can't 
select the pictures. Oh. Right. Doesn't make sense. I can't put that there. Do I have to put it in a different order? I can't remove it now. It's just on here. And they're not, they don't have to be in an order, I don't think. Okay, this isn't consistent with the, with the previous ones. Maybe that's why. Heart removed from chest, strapped by the wrists. Definitely, I don't know what I did. Murders, but this time the heart and the straps. Were I have no behind. idea. More clues to work with. This makes four murders that we know about. We're off to a good start. All right. The clues have resolved the open question and unlock a deduction. As you advance the investigation, new questions will be unlocked, updating your goals. So we're like real detectives here. We have to actually solve this. It's not going to solve itself. Somebody has to do it, and it's us. You can check the updated goals by pressing goals. Okay, investigate. Learn more about the person. Learn more about the unaliver. More, learn more about the unalivey and the unaliver. Okay, you are now free to examine. Okay, awesome. Who is our victim? Who okay. killed him? Need to find more clues. We got this. Wait, it's not Cat Graham? It's Melanie? Does anyone know? I mean, surely we can look this up. Right? Surely we could look this up. It's got to be in the Multiple credits, right? We're here. Do we know? Multiple killers? Look, I wasn't looking at the comments because I was busy trying to figure out how to put a photo on a board. It's Melanie? I don't know who that is. Look, I was busy trying to figure out something that was unimportant, and I did. I don't know who Melanie is. Someone was drinking beer. They spent time here. Ah, uh, this is, Waiting. is this about the, the unaliver? Someone left in a hurry, knocked the tripod over. Was it for a camera? Probably. <laughs> Wait, why is Elfie's eyes switching? Did, was there more information that I missed? <laughs> Pin the whole thing and I missed it. Oh, it's gone now. It's gone. We're never going to say it again. Why is there a three, a two and a three here? She was the character in This Is Us, HBO's The Idol and Netflix Gypsy. I've not seen any of those. I've heard of This Is Us, but that I've not I haven't heard of the other two. <laughs> 
And I haven't seen any of them, so maybe I've just seen her, like, on TV somewhere, but I don't actually know who she is. All right, have you identified him? Oh, I sure do. His name is Nightingale. He was FBI. He came to town about Let me see your face. years ago. Now, I haven't heard a word about him since. Well, until now. Nightingale. Robert Nightingale? Oh, yes. You probably She could just quit it. turning Mothers away. Arms. Oh, and sisters. Nightingale from the first one? I don't even know. I'm going to pretend that I know what happened in the first one. So you knew our victim? Well, I didn't recognize him in his current state. But yeah, I ran into him a few times at Quantico. Never worked any cases together. Sensitive content! Field, he went off the deep end. Got the boot pretty quick after that. Probably. Uh, maybe I've seen her in Game of Thrones. Okay, what happened? Oh, he's been... Wait. Nightingale went missing 13 years ago. 2010. The same as all the other victims. Certainly fits the pattern. Makes me wonder what was going on that year. Probably oh, something we're almost at our light goal, you guys. Forget. So what happened to Nightingale after the Bureau let him go? Who's Nightingale? I only know the rumors. Depression led to booze. Booze led to paranoia. He got some wild ideas in his head. That's not this guy, is it? Until he fell off the map. Guess he ended up here. I bet there's more to that. Oh, it's it this guy. No happy Wait, ending. he went missing ten years ago? And we've just now found him? Like this? That's unfortunate. Thirteen years. Uh, close enough. All right. Um, what else do we need? I think I've pretty much covered everything here. I'll be back in a second. Roger. Maybe he got missing, he went missing in time or something. You know, this is like sci fi stuff. Wonder what's inside. Confused? Follow these steps. Wash your hands, thing. take the chicken out of the fridge, take a nap. Okay, there's some sort of chest with a keypad on it. Oh, that's one of the symbols. A. Eh? A creepy twig sculpture? But isn't that the symbol on the box? I think I saw something. It'll only take a minute. Always here. Should I be back over there? <gasps> Flashlight. <gasps> There's a thing up there. Wait, take the chicken out of the fridge. Okay, triangles. What did it, what did it say? Set the timer or something or and then take a nap. What? Wash hands. Is that what it said? Wait, did it say wash hands first? Wash hands, fridge, nap. There's not a symbol on the, the sink. There's this on the cabinet. Hands, fridge, nap. Huh, maybe there's another sink? Or maybe it's that, but that's the clock. Oh, no, 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 okay. Okay, this one. Wash your hands. Take the chicken out of the fridge. And then take a nap. Okay. Hands fridge nap. Okay. 
Wait, that's a nap. But you're probably trained to joke about it, right? To deflect, hide the truth from the average Joe. Anderson. Hey. Hands. Work over here, can we? Up and down triangle. Wait, I don't remember. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, okay. Bridge. Okay. Yeah, okay, okay. It's like an hourglass. Got it. What is it? Don't take anything if you aren't one of the trees. Okay. What does that mean? I guess I'm a tree. All right, what do you guys want from me? I think I'm done here. You guys need anything else? I think I'm ready to go. This all checks out, Blood you know. The blood on the table. The oh. victim died here. I think that's everything, for now at least. Mm-hmm. Anything clicking yet? Not sure. Okay, we got some photos. Multiple sets of footprints. Oh, this is the guy. Okay. And then we have Nightingale went off the deep end, FBI fired him. Okay, that's also the guy. Robert Nightingale, ex-FBI, came to Bright Falls 13 years ago. This is kind of crazy. Oh, and then multiple sets of footprints. Bootprints indicating multiple killers. Oh man, I am getting Quite good. Funny. FBI fired because of Alan? Wait, really? He went missing after Alan, number one, and recently, oh. Okay, tripod found. Premeditated. He was waiting. Yeah, premeditated. They planned for the murder to happen here. <laughs> Passing the time with equipment ready. It's almost like Alan Wake him. 1 would have given us context. But why Nightingale? Baby. He's been missing for 13 years. Why here? <laughs> why now? Halima, thank you for the email message. Profiling. We are Getting halfway done with our emails. Hand. See what they saw. Feel what they felt. Use whatever I know about them to guide my intuition to a revelation. Piece it together. These graphics are amazing. Life of Bex! Glist. Glist. You can use profiling inside Saga's mind place to get inside the heads of these suspects and victims. Okay. Using her intuition, Saga can discover new clues by profiling people of interest. Agent Nightingale has been MIA for 13 years. How did he end up here? It's wild. Up from the lake that's not a lake. It's dark. He was there, too. You are not allowed in the lake until he says otherwise. Robert Nightingale came from the lake before his murder. How would we know that? Katie! Yeehaw! Nightingale was chosen as the victim. Why? Click the switch. It goes click. Lights are off, but somebody's home. Somebody's home. This wasn't some random act of violence. This was a ritual, a nightingale a component. 
They didn't see him as a person. More like a container for something. This is crazy. I love it. I'm like Sherlock Holmes over here. All right, what do you guys want me to do now? I think I'm done here. Can I leave? You're confused? Me too. Um, what are our goals? Investigate the crime scene, profile. We did that. Aren't we done? We profiled him. Skiggles, thank you for the hanging gaslights. That's what this game is doing to me. Maybe I need more clues? Possibly. I want to go home now. Can you guys tell me where to go? That would be really cool. Go to the lake. Should I go to the lake? Wait. Oh, that's a good idea. They came from the lake. You just shared the live with Ferrari? That's awesome. Get them in here. I want to walk around for a minute. You know where to find me. All right, how do I get down to the lake? A lake that's not a lake. That's dark. I mean, he came from the lake, so I could just go to the regular lake. <gasps> There's something. Oh, I can climb that if I want. All right. Am I headed the right way? Okay, if I head straight, I'll basically follow a trail that's going to lead me to the shore. Wait, it's covered in water. Can't go any further. Water's too deep. What? Wait, now it's covered in water? It wasn't a second ago on the map. Am I crazy? There was like, was it like high tide or something? So this is like a tide situation. We are playing. Are we getting smaller? We're playing um, Alan Wake 2. We just started it. If you haven't followed, make sure you hit that follow button. Wait, there's a cabin. <gasps> the witch's hut? Here lived the witch of Cauldron Lake, beware her spirit may still haunt this place. Sounds promising. What is this with this weird lighting on the floor? There's an actual cauldron in here. Wait, everything's moving. Did I do that? Oh, I'm knocking stuff over. Okay. Awesome. Well, there's nothing in here, so I guess I'll leave. 
Looks like footsteps, it does. Am I supposed to be running around the woods? Friday, Midge told me today that her family is moving away. This sucks. I haven't even told her that I like her yet. What's the point anymore? I've said her parents want to get better jobs. She said her parents want to get better jobs and get her to a better school in a big city. I guess that's fair. Who wants to stay in bright fudging falls anyways? Sunday. So I told her. She said, thanks. That sucks. <laughs> that sucks. Monday. <laughs> I snuck out last night again, went to the big house by the lake instead of just watching it from here like I always do, instead of just sitting around like I always do. Anyway, something weird is going on down there. I'm going to find out what, what, going to go back there tomorrow with better gear. I bet I can find a way inside the building, take some photos. It's going to be epic. Cool. I wonder how that went. Jay, thank you for the hanging gas lights. <laughs> so shit, wait, where did he go? Is that a kids lunchbox? Where? What am I looking at? Heidi B! Thank you for the email message. Thank you so much. What did you email me? I hope it was something good. You went to the house by the lake? Oh, wait. Oh, here. Here it is. An Alex Casey movie lunchbox. Casey hates the endless jokes about coincidentally having the same name as a fake detective. He I know things can get a little crazy around here. He really hates the movies. I know things can get a little crazy around here, but if you ever if you're ever feeling scared, just remember that Alan is watching over us. You think the email might be getting smaller? Okay. <laughs> Who's Alan? The name of the game is called Alan Wake. He's the guy. I don't know. He's main guy. Manuscript fragments can be used to upgrade pew pews in the mind place. Oh. Well, I just have one, so I can't do anything with it. Are we getting smaller? All right, I'm just gonna like, I guess get out of here. I don't really know. Oh wait, maybe I'll go this way. How far in these woods can I explore before they're like, hey, we're supposed to be doing a job here. The guy who we don't know what happened to him, the, that guy, cause we definitely finished Alan Wake 1. Yeah, we definitely finished it. I should have read the cliff notes. Angel! Angel, thank you for the email message. What'd you email me? What'd you email me? We finished it in the mind place. That's right, we did. Look, um... Alan Wake 1 was extremely stressful. And I just don't feel like it was for us. You know? I don't think it was for us. Maybe for somebody else, but I don't think I don't think it was us. Where are we? Wait, we're at the general store. Weren't they at the general store? Wait, I'm confused. Where are they? Where are we? 
Where... Where am I? Monday. Some suspicious activity spotted. The fielder thought he saw... Movement in the bushes. Footprints around the area were found, but some were compromised by the fielder. Note to self, train the fielder. Tuesday, nothing to report. Some animals, regular. Wednesday, hunters out after dark. Poachers heard some pew pews. Not one of ours. Gotta keep an eye on these people. They could get more than they bargained for out there. Hey, Casey, what's the forest favorite shape? Please, Anderson, just one case without the rent. A triangle. I don't get it. Yes, you do. Hey, we got a picture for the case. Okay. Locked. They left a lot of garbage. Not the fastidious type. Are these the people that... You guys, I think I'm lost. In the woods. Oh, never mind. I found him. I found him. It's okay. I'm good. Good to see you still in one piece, Anderson. Yeah, we're here. Forest can be a dangerous place. So, can we leave now? I looked at everything. Um, and I'm ready to go. They still want us to profile the guy. I'm going to add the picture. Nightingale came from Cauldron Lake. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, zoom out. Okay. Victim came from... There. I can feel that Nightingale came from the lake, but why now, after 13 years, where's he been? Is that all I have? Finding a Casey movie lunchbox out here can't be a coincidence. Another message? Well, we don't need a map. We don't need a map, you guys. We got this. For later, okay. Uh, lunchbox found near which, which is hut at Cauldron Lake. Mm. No. Okay. Wait. Uh. Oh. Wait. This. There. Okay, we got one. Let's go to a, the other case. And we have nothing else. This is all that we've got so much information already. Are we done profiling? Investigate the crime scene. Check the lake shore. Oh, okay. The lake is connected to Nightingale somehow. Already. Our goal. Let's take a look down by the lake. Lead the way. We finished our Sounds goal. Hold good. on. Let me update uh, it. Way, right? How right. far are we away from rank eight? Well, just, or, uh, yeah, how far away? Let's do, we're investigating. So we're going to do hats and mustaches. Hats and mustaches. I'm not going to do too many of them. Tammy! Thank you for the mirror bloom. Thank you, Tammy. 
Skiggles! Yeehaw! That's right. Kirsten! Yeehaw! Yeehaw! Thank you, Jay. Layla! Yeehaw! This is one of your hunches, Anderson. Did something happen at the lake? I think Emma, yeehaw, lucky, yeehaw, how to be, yeehaw, yeehaw. Safety. They were waiting for him. When you're ready, I'd love to hear what you put together so far. Sure. He should really get one of these it's mind not rooms. Nightingale was out in the woods alone at night, possibly nude. <gasps> the killers knew he was here, ambushed him. What was that? Dragged him to the campgrounds, strapped him to the table, cut his heart out. But then they were interrupted by those witnesses, the bookers. The job is unfinished. That seems pretty complicated. Eden! Yeehaw! Melissa! Yeehaw! Jess! Yeehaw! Mm-hmm. Lots of questions. Lots of answers for us to find. I didn't know trees. Got Mac! Yeehaw! Yeehaw! Creeps. You need to get out more. It is kind of creepy, though. <gasps> Look at the feet! There's a piece of paper on the ground. Okay. Tracks. Barefoot. Nightingales? Yeah, but they're like... They come out from under the boulder. It makes no sense. They're like... They're like tar footprints. Angel! Yeehaw! Yeehaw! A page full of text on one side. Not a printout. Written with a typewriter. Old school. Lines scratched out and edits added with a pen. Mm-hmm. Like a manuscript. A page of a story. Hmm. The killer left a message. It's for us. The text is about us. The victim was one of their own, FBI Special Agent Robert Nightingale. And then there was the page they found, the first step down into terrifying depths. Yeah, we should be wearing reading, gloves. Reading the words. These, These words, words felt like a message. Felt like a message. Someone knew they were here. Someone That's played Alan. a game with them. An invitation. It's Alan. How, How could, could they, they not accept, accept even, even if, if they, they knew, knew it would end up hurting them? Alan kind of looks like Jared Leto, doesn't he, though? He does. Came with us. You His right. new look. This is right up my alley. Nightingale came this way. Either he dropped this page, or the killers left it for us. Oh, I should okay. profile Nightingale about this page. Let's profile him. We got a new profile, the page. We found a page in the woods. A story about these events. What is Nightingale's role in this? I carry his words close to my chest now. Inside. The Why does his voice sound like that? He must dig it out. Something was put inside him. In his chest. I must find out what. Wait, something, they put something. He's talking in front of a fan. <laughs> it does kind of sound like that. They put something inside of his chest. Oh, wait. We have this now. Wait, we've got a bunch of stuff. Okay, footprints emerging from under a rock. Trail has gone cold.
Trail has gone cold. Does this go here? Okay. I think he came from the lake. Anything else his here? Tracks make no sense. Nightingale has something hidden inside of him. Reading the words, these words felt like a message, someone playing a game with them. Found all I can here. Time to properly examine the body. That's right. See what I can find inside. Okay. Casey, I think something's been put inside Nightingale's body. Let's tell the deputies to get the body to the town morgue. Okay. Whoever wrote that page made sure it read like a story. Like a scene from a Properly. Film. I hate all of it. I am a great detective, detective aren't I? Find more. I believe it. But what's the purpose? They're twisting events to create their own narrative to do what? Entertain some fantasy? Projecting their desires? Are we characters or the audience? Witnesses to their design? Hey, you made all it back. It's all about control. Deciding what happens to who. Don't let it drag you in. Too late. All, all right. I need the Partner. Instructor. I hope you didn't get stuck in any of those big puddles. Crazy flooding down there, huh? Just like I said. Yeah, the whole beach is gone. Deputy, I want the body taken back to town for a proper examination, ASAP. Well, sure. But the coroner won't be back in town for another week after Deerfest. Not a problem. I'll do it fest. Oh, and Sheriff Breaker called to say he's got the bookers at the Oh Dear Diner in town. Oh, and I've got a key. Is this the, the same gate. place? It's a shortcut back to the parking lot just up the hill. The Alan Wake one happened in? ADHD! Thank you for the annoying Mr. Orange and starting off our annoying Mr. Orange goal. Thanks. Let's take, take the, the car. car. Drive to Bright Falls. Oh, I get to drive? Let's to go. Witnesses, the bookers. At the diner, right? I, I could use a cup of coffee. Let's try yeah. that shortcut the deputy mentioned. Sounds good. Allie, Agena, thank you Seems both like for the annoying so Mr. Orange. Pretty wood. Kirsten, thank you for Pretty the annoying Mr. Orange. We should go for a hike if we get a chance. Now you're just being mean. Man. I don't want to hike with him. He's exactly such a downer. To the task, but hopefully the sheriff will be more helpful. Not a surprise about the death. Layla, thank you for the annoying Mr. Orange. Okay, we're getting we're getting our cardio in. Yet. Heart removed. Got to get our steps going. Tripod. Tracks leading to a dead end. Tripod. Is he going to climb up this? To record a, a snuff film? He did. Maybe. And why take out his heart just to throw it away? To stuff in something for us to find. Is he old or is he not old? I can't tell. I thought he was like our age, but now I'm starting to think he's older. Is he going to jump down this? Where is he? Oh, here we are. Let's drive back to town and meet the sheriff at the diner. I'll drive. Oh, that's not our car. I got this. I can't get that manuscript page out of my head. <laughs> I've never seen killers reach out so directly before. Damn impressive work so far. With your technique, these hunches were moving fast. He recognizes my technique. I wasn't sure about taking a case so far from home, but I'm thrilled to be here for this mystery. Sean, thank you for the annoying Mr. Orange. Hey, look, they put some guy in like, what is that? To get anything from the field office? Spray no, paint? Sure. I'll pop Suit? Anyway. Could you I'll imagine? Go the get a feel for the town. He's in the street. He can't see. Someone should lead him back to the sidewalk. 
But what happened to Alan and Alice? Look. What happened was... The diner's just up the waterfront. Shouldn't keep the sheriff and our witnesses waiting. I smell coffee. Y'all should back what up. What coffee have you had today, Charlie? <laughs> don't know, don't care. <laughs> How much have you had? Not enough. That's how much. Can Never you see? Coffee. Oh, that rich, bittersweet nectar. Get it in coffee world. Get it where you can. Get it now. Jesus, Charlie. Ah. Personal oh, space. Sweating in these suits, isn't it? Charlene, are you as uncomfortable as I am? You don't think the amount of hot caffeinated beverages you've downed has anything to do with it? I don't know what you're talking about. This is pretty what good. In hell, Swamp Ass City. Ugh. Change of topic, please. Huh. What a terrible job. Not to toot my own horn, but I am pretty darn sure my, <laughs> I mean our float, will be the belle of the ball at this year's Deer Fest. Just a few more days. What's Deer Fest? What is their town called? Wait, Bright Falls? So this is where, up. is this be where right the back. first Alan Wake was that we, that's what we decided? The first Alan Wake was here? Is this it? Oh no, this is Clay's clam house. Uh let me guess. Oh, here, here. Hi. Welcome to Bright Falls. <laughs> it's nice to have you here. I got you both some coffee. Oh, it's Washington's finest. Can you imagine? <laughs> they, 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 they set a bunch of deer loose to run a 5k on Main Street. <laughs> I really want to see that. Nice to meet you, Sheriff. I'm set for coffee. You know, I wouldn't say no to another. I'm Agent Saga Anderson. This is Agent Alex Casey. Tim Breaker. And let me just say, I'm happy you two are here. Frankly, we could use the help. Is that the guy from Man of Medan? The brother? Right? I mean, he's also a, a TV star, but he was in Man and Medan that we played just recently. He's got a beard now, though, and he escaped from the pirates just to come back to the ship by himself, which was very unfortunate. All right. Caitlin, thank you for the annoying Mr. Orange. Your deputy said you had a couple of witnesses here. They made them sound like suspects. Thank Mulligan you for two of them. Thank that. you. No, no. The bookers don't strike me as the murdering type, but you can decide for yourselves. They're just inside having coffee and pie to calm their nerves. He looks I'll better with a, with a beard. Casey, you compare notes with the sheriff. Take your time. We've looked through the case files you sent over, Sheriff. Have you had many people raising the roof? Thank you for the five sure. subs. Thank you so much. Missing person cases spiked around 2010. The fence was built just after. If you just got a sub, congratulations. Dude, I'm like walking around here with my flashlight shining it in these people's eyes. I can't believe that you like that oatmeal? Excuse me. Come I'm Agent Saga Anderson. Are you the bookers? That's us? I'm Tammy How would I know that? Oh, officer. Just Saga is fine, Ed. So are we being charged with anything? Because if not, we'd love to get back to our hotel and decompress after what we saw. Take a bath, screw into pillows, that kind of thing. We're not charging you. I just have a few questions. Wait, Nothing charging them with about. what? Okay. What would we charge them with? Didn't they just find it? Wait, did they find it? They found it. Why would we charge them? 
I don't think that's how that works. Ash, thank you for the annoying Mr. Orange. All right, tell me what, what you saw. What were you doing at Colgen late last night? I'm a oh. writer. True crime. We're here from New York, doing some research on a famous novelist, Alan Wake, who went missing here. I was down at the lake, getting some details. Perfectly legal. Her eye contact is too much. It's too much. So what did you see in the woods? This naked dude came out of the lake and he was acting crazy, shouting weird shit at us. He must have been on something. Wait, he saw them? Skinny dipping at dawn is a thing around here. Then we heard shooting. We ran into these psychos in gear masks. His eye contact's kind of a lot too. Into the naked guy with knives, like some kind of satanic cult. Wait, y'all saw the whole thing? And then we bolted and called the cops. You guys seem very calm. What makes you say it was a cult? The masks and knives aren't enough. I mean, they were shouting, cult of the tree, the cult of the tree, cult of the tree. Oh. I'm not a tree, a you guys. I changed my mind. The whole thing was terrifying. That's all. What happened to my vision? I changed my mind. I don't want to be a tree. I don't, I don't want to be that anymore, okay? Caitlin, thank you for the annoying Mr. Orange and finishing our annoying Mr. Orange goal. <laughs> Ask them more. Okay, let me update our goal before I get LP staring me down. And right, we're gonna do chilies. Chilies. Not Tammy staring me down now. Yo, BC staring me down, you guys. I didn't do anything. All right, who are we profiling? The bookers now? See, I don't have to. Yeah, you've gotten you've gotten your minions to do it for you. W chat. <laughs> the cult of the tree. What are the bookers telling me? I found their necklace. The symbol is two triangles. The cult wants their spruce tree back, Tammy. Finder's keeper is Ed. My publisher will want this on the cover. Tammy found something. A necklace belonging to one of the cultists. Oh, well, that's so weird. They like lined their eyes up and s that's strange. Kind of cool. The bookers were at Cauldron Lake. Why? This was built to hide what's there. They say the rider fell in the lake. Private party. No trespassing. My book has questions. Past the bolt cutters. They broke in for the sake of Tammy's book. Nothing to do with a murder. They were telling the truth. Yeah, but she took something, right? They said that Tammy took something. Can I? Oh, do we have another case file? Oh, wait. Where do I put this? There. Okay. We're dealing with an organized group of killers, not a lone serial killer. So it's not one person. It's a whole group. So you found something there, right? A necklace these cultists may have dropped. Okay. Wow. How did you put that together? It's evidence. You need to hand it over. 
I told you not to keep that thing to me. Tammy, what did you take? The eye contact really is a lot. I agree. It's a lot. Do me a favor. Stick around town for now in case we have any more questions. <laughs> like we'd even dream of missing dear Oh, God. Saga! Saga Anderson. As I live and breathe. I thought we'd never see you back here after that awful, awful thing happened to your baby girl. How are you? Um... I'm sorry. Who are you? That feels a little personal. I don't know what you're talking about. It's me, silly. Rose. You know me. I don't think I do. And what horrible thing what? happened to my baby girl? She drowned. Your daughter. That's so weird. You don't remember. How do you know I have a daughter? Oh, I know what this is. You're blocking out your traumatic memories. Happens on TV all the time. No. What? You're mistaking me for someone else. If you say so. Wait, excuse me. Also, wasn't the previous waitress's name Rose as well, or was the name different? Case closed. The cold of the trees behind these murders. This case just became much more complicated. I'll need to start a new file. But it's my first cold case. Exciting. Should we be concerned about what she just said? Because apparently we actually do have a daughter. And why was she so casual about, like, reminding us about it? I need to know more about the code of the tree if I'm going to shut them down. Oh, we got a new case. How many cases are we going to get? That's not right. Who's involved? And then... What kind? Oh, symbols, okay. They were wearing masks. Mm. How many cases do we have? Okay. Okay, then we got this one. These stashes could contain clues about the cult. Better keep an eye out for more. <laughs> we might need to make an emote for this game for what? I know. I agree. I agree. I feel like Math Lady this whole game so far. I'm definitely Math Lady. I don't know what's going on at all. A cult murdering a man is pretty extreme. <laughs> Why didn't you tell the police what you saw? We did. We told those two idiot deputies they didn't listen. And they wanted to throw Ed and I in jail for that murder. You know, Bright Falls is just Alabama with bigger trees. This is my case now, and no one is throwing you in jail. If I don't know why someone else, would throw you guys in jail. I mean, unless you guys did it, but I don't think you did. Thank you, Saga. You quit making the crazy eye contact at me, though. It's too much. Look away every now and then, or blink or something, I don't know. 
Why is there a moose in the high chair? All set. My guys uh, have nightingale yeah, morgue. All set. Ready to go take a look. Let's go. Well, Casey, I got a lead. Looks like we're dealing with a cult. The cult of the tree. A murder cult. Fuck. Yeah. Have you heard of this <laughs> cult of the tree, Sheriff? Only the urban legend. If you're in the woods at night, the cult will get you. That sort of thing. We're not gonna find out you're the Grand Wizard or something, are we? That's a weird thing to say. Back in the day, the wizard was always my favorite class. Morning, Sheriff. Looks like you have some. We need. To, we do need to go to Deerfest. Uh, morning, Ted. Yeah. I want to see the 5K guess. deer. Deerfest. Run. Always draws a crowd, right? <laughs> Too true. More the merrier. Have a good one, Sheriff. Yo, why are we kneeling? Oh, is it? Hey, what do you know about that waitress from the diner? <laughs> Rose? Yeah, she's a bit of a space case. She always has been. Why? What'd she do now? She kept saying that my daughter drowned. She even knew my name. It was all very weird. Rose has a talent for saying the weirdest thing possible. Hey, that phone is ringing. That's not to take it personally. There's a phone ringing in there. Why would they just have a phone ringing at a store and an answer machine answer it in a game that meant nothing? It that had to mean something, right? What a weird thing to add. Hey boss, corpse is downstairs ready to go. Yep, in the morgue. Oh, All we got right. a map. I'd like to take a closer look as soon as possible. Lead the way, Sheriff. Well, yeah, lead the way. I'll be right with you, sir. Oh, this is the Bright Falls Sheriff yep, yep. Station. Just Anything you need, just uh, let us know. We appreciate the support, money. Sheriff. How are you? Oh, we achieved our chili goals. All right. So we should have more with the funeral home next door. It's a shoestring budget. Corn. I guess you guys don't have that problem though. Our only corn is between a few other towns, and he's away this week. But you can handle this, right? I'm qualified to perform examinations. Yes. Something about morgues. They always cheer me up. I can't say I feel the same. He's oh, joking. yeah. All right, we're going to do corn. Y'all got that one really fast. I'm going to do... I'm going to make it a little more difficult. There we go. Good luck. Every time I do 6,969 corn, it takes you guys like three hours. <laughs> it takes so long. <laughs> Can't do it anymore. Okay. 10K Let's corn? Let's take a look at our patient. I'll start with the external inspection before performing the internal examination. Oh, am I doing this? Y'all don't want to have a doctor do this? What was the cause of death? What other clues can this looks like text? A tattoo? Nightingale didn't strike me as a tattoo guy. Uh huh. They did leave something uh -huh. inside his chest. Carla, thank you for the corgi. Yeah. It's Carla, right? Defensive wounds. He put up a fight. There's writing on here. Can't make it out. Writing? How it's corn. That? Hey, there is writing. The body shows signs of being submerged in water post mortem. He is not kind of. It doesn't add up. Y'all lost control. All right, case board. We got so many cases. 
time to see what Nightingale's body can tell us. Anything to learn. Doesn't make sense. Wait, this is the cause. Wait. Okay. Chest wound is cause of death, but the corpse is bloated, waterlogged. Doesn't add up. There's definitely something in his chest. Did the killers leave it there? <laughs> I just realized I'm making those faces. All right, perfect. Oh, more, there's more? <sighs> Ooh. She's not wearing gloves. Oh, don't touch it, don't just touch it. Why you gotta touch it? Okay, we should put on gloves. It's the same type of page we found at Cauldron Lake. We're just touching it. Nightingale hunted Saga. Didn't see her. The Taken could not see into bright light. Light hurt them, made them vulnerable. Nightingale had no heart, but here he was, killing. Someone's created a fucked up fantasy about us. Let's put our fingerprints all over everything. Hey, hold on. We found these kinds of pages. I didn't think they were relevant to this case. I have them right here. <laughs> Her partner's like, why no gloves? Wait, 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 what? Sheriff? What the hell? Whoa! Show me the clicker. Try to stay in the light to avoid being detected. Okay, great. Awesome. Awesome. He can't see me in the light. Oh, good. Excellent. Oh, these lights go out. My gun's out in the hall. Gotta get it back. Safe havens will restore some of your health if you leave or attack from a safe haven while in combat, it will become temporarily unavailable. <sighs> Gotta move, now.
He didn't have a heart. But he still got up. The page predicted all of it. It helped me fight him. Oh, oh, oh. He, he just disappeared? Yeah. What the hell is going on here? We need to figure that out if we're going to do anything about it. Saga was back at Cauldron Lake. Saga had to pursue Nightingale into the overlap. Finding a way <sighs> in would be difficult. A ritual. Saga would learn how. Stop the monster. Is Alan writing? Is that what's happening? And like now all these things are happening because he's writing. Could he not? Could he not? Just not do it? The heart is gone too. Did the fucker take it with him? There is no rational explanation to what we just saw. Are we Saga? We're Anderson. The sun. Mass hallucination caused by inhaling volcanic gas, but we both know that's bullshit. This was supernatural. Well, I'm glad you were the one to say it. Now we can figure out a way forward. Right before things got crazy, Sheriff Breaker just vanished. Maybe the Sheriff knew more than he was letting on. Hmm. He seemed anxious, like he dreaded what was coming. One more mystery. We're Saga? We're Saga Anderson. The victim of a ritualistic murder turns into a monster. And we're in... Is there a connection? Alan's Looks story. Me, like the cult of the tree is performing rituals to create monsters. I don't mm, know. Maybe. Okay, there's a lot of information we happening. This cult's goal, their purpose. This whole game is information. Okay, figure out where Nightingale went. I don't. Honestly, I don't want to know. If we could just not, that would be great. Must be locked from the other side. Can we just go home? Call it a day. We should probably let somebody know about this. Um. Maybe Saga was the friends we made along the way, yeah. It doesn't budge. Is everybody gone? Oh. Okay, well, everything's locked. There's a room behind here. It's blocked off. What happened? Well, what happened was... Nightingale was on the table. Then he wasn't. Can't be opened on this side. That's about the gist of it. Where's the heart? You know, I, I don't have an answer for that. Savannah, thank you for the 300 corn. It's corn. I would like to go in this room. I would like to go anywhere. Just, I can't force it open. Just anywhere. A dead man turned into a monster. Light as a way to fight him. Pages predicting the future. There's no rational explanation. 
This is the case we must solve. Kristen, thank you for the 100 corn. Right, maybe we have to do all this before we can do anything else. Okay, Saga was back at Cauldron Lake. He was there to a taken a creature of darkness. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Saga had to pursue Nightingale into the overlap. Finding a way in would be difficult. Casey, the cult of the tree, is performing rituals to create monsters. Feels like a cult kind of goal. Okay. The person's body was covered in writing. Page found inside. Nightingale was the only person to not to become a monster. Was that the goal? Hmm. Person of the cult unaliving became a monster. <sighs> that feels like a goal. Okay, no more profiling to do. We've done everything. Jay, thank you for all the sharing of the live. Thank you, I see you. Okay, that's locked. I've, I've done our case folder thing. Okay. The page places Nightingale back at Cauldron Lake. Calls him a Taken. We need to head over there, stop him, before anyone else gets hurt. Okay. All right, let's go. Track Nightingale at Cauldron Lake. We, we heard gunshots, Yolo. Where have you guys been? Did you get spooked by the bodies? Sheriff Breaker disappeared. That's what you have to say? Nightingale turned into some sort of a monster and there are offices down. You two handle things here. We need to get back to Cauldron Lake immediately. Fuck me. That's terrible. We'll do what we can, man. Does their reaction seem... a little calm for what just I'm happened? Nightingale's heart was missing. How could he do anything? He's dead. Like, right? A little weird. Easy talk. Monsters aren't real, and what do you mean the, the sheriff appeared? Like poof? Like magic? Magic's not real. Magic's not real. Right? Mulligan? No, Thorn. Monsters aren't real, and magic's definitely not real. I knew that. Are they tree people? Or are they just incompetent? Like... <laughs> do they know something we don't know? Or they just don't know anything at all? <laughs> like, I can't tell. <laughs> They're either hiding something or they just... Not that smart. I don't know what's going on either, but... Can't open this with my bare hands. Okay, we don't have a key. Why are you following me like I know where I'm going? Fine pair. 
I don't know how they got their job, but they did. Oh dear, I am a tourist, and it appears that I'm lost in the woods. It only had a tour guide, also, bear season. Oh no, a bear. Help. Did somebody call for a tour guide? Oh wow, Koskala Brothers Adventure Tours. Unforgettable tour experiences at affordable prices. That's right, I'm Ilmo Koskala voted best coffee roaster slash tour guide by Coffee World Magazine, and I'm here to give you the tour of a lifetime. But Ilmo, <laughs> I've heard the government has seized and restricted access to many local nature attractions. That is true, Yanko. Many local attractions have recently become fed Where are they by from? the government. And that's why at Koskala Brothers Adventure Tours, we say, but the government. We have both cutters. Oh, wow. You think of everything. And we'll take you anywhere. <laughs> Hiking through the scenic Elderwood National Park. Fishing in the crystal clear waters of Bright Falls Dam. Are they finished? Watching at Majestic Mirror Peak. The tour of a lifetime <laughs> is just one phone call away. Book now to get a 9% discount on this limited edition Oh Dear Diner Coffee Thermos. Well, they definitely weren't American. And I know in control, they have like a Finnish guy in there. I'm wondering if they're Finnish. But he sounded like super Finnish. Cesaro, thank you for the prime sub. Welcome to the family. That was a great commercial. I would take their tour. What are you doing in here? I'll just shut that. <laughs> Am I allowed just back here? My client has been held here long enough. Are you gonna let me speak to them or not? Uh just a moment, ma'am. Someone will be right with you. Well, I'm just like on their computers too. Thank you, Halima, for the corn and the flaming flamingo. Nope. I can't say your name. Oh, I can't say the first part of it. Thank you for the corn. I don't know if this is going to have anything important on it. I'm not going to read it. It's too much. <laughs> Excuse me, what? I can't say the whole name, okay? <laughs> it's not opening. How many times do we have to do this, Walter? Huh? I'm at my wit's end with you. Walter's not saying anything. Do you think I like throwing you in jail every other day? No. Ask I Christian don't. if he loves forest you sprites. Have any idea how much paperwork you're causing me? What's well, a lot? I want out. Something bad's going down. I can feel it. Well, you got that right. Sit here and stew for a while. Think about your life choices, buddy. Is it worth it for Corn this? goal achieved? Not yet. Not yet. We're getting there. We're at 1600 corn. 
Can we leave now? What's our goal? Track Nightingale at Cauldron Lake. Okay. Do we just go back to Cauldron Lake? Nightingale and his cult are dangerous. We need to be prepared in case things escalate more than they already have. Can you call it in, Casey? Smart choice, Anderson. Are we seeing the pass? No, I don't think so. Yeah, Agent Casey here. Yeah. We need backup. The Wait, backup where are you going? Whoever you can spare. ASAP. Think we'll actually find Nightingale at the lake? The pages haven't been wrong yet. We can't assume the person writing these pages isn't playing us. I agree. But it's our best That's my... I'm gonna take a quick look around. What's my go-to Thai food? Mmm. Okay, if I'm at the restaurant, then pad thai, because it's best when you get it there. If you get it to go, it just never tastes as good. I don't know why. I'm not sure. Did you check out the town, Anderson? Just getting my bearings. Am I Ready supposed to check out the town? Waiting on you. If I'm getting it to go, then um, uh, Thai basil chicken, like the stir fry. Get a beer. So good. Well, maybe three. Car can use to be travel or to travel between locations. Am I supposed to check out the town? Good to see you. I mean, I don't really, you know. Do you guys want to check out the town? Let's find toilets. Yes, I am. Look around. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Calm down. What are we looking at? The sign? How are you? Enjoy your day. Okay. How about that weather forecast for Deerfest? I've been working on this float for a month straight. If it rains, I am gonna lose it. It'll ruin all the paper mache. That shit is delicate. I'm sure we'll get a nice sunny day. Oh, so now you're a veteran. Uh, Alright, we went into the Deer Diner. Oh, Deer Diner, can we go into this restaurant? Oh, wait, who are you? What are you holding? Talk. Okay, can we go in here? Okay, can't go in there. What about that place with the ringing phone? Have a nice day. It's so quiet here now. Maybe the Cupid and Hester flew over the Rainbow Bridge. <laughs> Do you fellas ever miss them? Do you miss your parents? Remember to have some sustenance, my little ones. It'll keep you warm and full of energy. It'll keep you soaring in the sky. You don't want to plummet down to the ground. Trust me, it's not. Aren't the crows the ones that fly after us? Are you napping? I think he's napping. Why do they want me to check out the town?
You guys aren't even talking. You're just looking at each other. What about this place? What a noob! <laughs> Thank you for the prime sub, your third month! Thank you so much. Remember, if you are watching on Twitch, if you have Amazon Prime, you can sub for free and not have to watch ads. We're going to the lake. This place doesn't have a lot going on. The people who live here are questionable. Like, what is she doing? Is she hiding? Can't see her? Yeah. <laughs> She's really good. Feels like home. Yeah, I saw the town. I think we're just gonna go. If you're here too long, I think you just stay here forever. You're just here forever. I need to come clean, Anderson. Anita I Brown, I Ashley, Anita thank you guys for the corn. Ago, he was chasing a writer. Alan. Wake. Alan. Tammy mentioned him. She's writing a book on his disappearance. You know the detective character from his books, Alex Casey. Yeah, I've heard the jokes at the office. Cold case Casey. Murder case Casey. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, Wait, who's Casey? Same name, similar job. It's the first thing anyone thinks of. It annoyed me, but that was it. Then, Wait, he's Casey. years ago, I started getting strange letters in the mail. Fragments of prose describing murders. You've heard the stories about what happened in New York. Some of it, at least. Bodies started to pile up. It was a Just murder kidding. cult. Turns testing you guys sent to me were from the crime books of Alan Wake the cult was copycatting the murders from the books changing it in their heads they were performing a ritual to bring Wake back their imagined prophet after that case I started looking into Wake's disappearance on the side and you thought this case might be connected to him his name does keep popping up I just wanted you to have all the facts. Next time, give them to me before we find ourselves in the middle of a horror story. You guys want the glist? Glist fest for deer fest? The page says Nightingale's in something called an overlap. Need to figure out exactly what that means. I'm happy I'm not in charge of this mess. Thanks. Let's start looking for Nightingale where he was killed. Glistening, return of the glist. Give the glist a rest? We'll do a short glist. It's a short one. Great. This area is supposed to be close to the public. And Gina! Glist. The flaming glist. Anita Brown. Glist. 
You'll get the bell the today. of these pages knows what will happen. Because they're behind this? Or because they can see what's coming? Impossible things are happening here. A world operating on different rules. I need to understand this strange logic. To see the clues. To solve the case. Heidi B! The list! All right, we're going down to the lake. Whoa. Tammy, Glist. I've been thinking more about the cult of the tree. What sort of cult refers to themselves as a cult? In my experience, they don't. Hey, who are these guys? We're not seeing the full picture hey. yet. Hey, hello there. How are you folks doing? Those restricted areas. Hello. Don't do Saga Anderson. Are you two supposed to be here? <sighs> I'm Ilma Koskela. Fantastic to meet you. And yes, Stephen here hired me to show him through the woods. He's in town on important government business. He's the guy! Fixing this impressive piece of hardware. I work for the FBC, ma'am. I'm authorized to be here. And I bet you two are here about that murder. FBC? Nasty stuff. How's it going? Gen X Gen! Glist. Yeah, he's got the bolt cutters. How did you hear about the murder, Ilmo? Do you know anything that could help us? People tend to tell me things. The Koskala brothers are kind of a household name around here. Speaking of, uh, if you're looking for some fun, stop by Watery. Just down the road from Bright Falls, there's our Coffee World Amusement Park. There's Sauna, Sauna da Vista. <laughs> and we offer a variety of guided tours, hunting, fishing, He's hiking, definitely finished. Whatever strikes your fancy. You name it, we probably got it. Jax, Missy, Pole Life, Glist. What is this thing? It's just a monitoring station, ma'am. The Federal Bureau of Control checks volcanic activity and air toxicity levels. No need to worry, though. It's mostly for research purposes. That's one gorgeous wetter saga. <laughs> Looks Nordic. I bet a family member made it. My mother made this sweater for me. How do you know? I knew it. My mom used to knit those sweaters I for me see and my, my sweater. brother. Watery, my hometown, was founded by Finnish immigrants. So between your name and the sweater, I figured your family might be from Finland too. Suomi, Finland. Hulla, Karjalan <laughs> Close. My mom's family is from Sweden originally. I don't know much about them beyond that. The sweater is just something to remember her by. Stephen, we're investigating a murder that occurred nearby. What can you tell me about your bureau? Nothing that isn't classified, I'm afraid. But I don't know anything about a murder. Operations here are run by a different department. I'm just here to make some repairs. The wiring on this thing frays every couple months. Yep, that's the raccoons. They that's the people that's in control. Teeth, like you wouldn't believe. Can not run through a garbage can. That's all I've got for the, the FBC. Moment. The bureau is the yeah, federal the bureau of, of control. Everything. Asian triple glist. That's right. Oh, there's something up here. A lunchbox again. Who's oh, it's one of the here? fragments. We can upgrade our weapon with these. We got two of them. I wonder what this thing is. Get down. Station 11. Clear signs of tampering. Signal was rerouted into transmitter that is not one of ours. I fixed it so it so any alerts will come our way, but it's definitely concerning. I'll make a report for the investigation department. Leaving this here in case I'm not next the next person to fix this thing. If you're reading this, check for tampering. We may want to put more secure metal casing around the whole thing. 
so that the rac the raccoons can't get to it anymore. Let's get to the murder. Who are the ra who are the raccoons? A lot of things about this case keep bothering me. But one thing feels really off. Breaker's disappearance. I don't get the feeling Nightingale was responsible. Hmm. He was about to give you more of those pages. Something didn't want us to Furry happen. woodland creatures, that's or true. Was protecting him from Nightingale? Hey, it's I'm all flooded now. I don't know why. Not the kind of Even more than before. Our crime scene's drowning. I never minded rain. Feels like home. No sign of Nightingale. But the page did place him at Cauldron Lake in an overlap. So how do we follow him there? Maybe something around here will tell us. Savannah! Glist! Heidi B! Double glist! And Kelsey's, Kelsey's, thank you for the tier one sub. And Pia Moro, I don't know if I'm saying that right. Thank you for the prime sub. Welcome both of you to the family. Heck yeah. Oh yeah, there's a bell now. There's a bell. After we find Nightingale, what then? I've never arrested a monster. I've watched you arrest plenty of monsters, Anderson. You know what I mean. Monster monsters. Light worked against him at the morgue. That might be the only way to stop him from hurting anyone else. Monsters? Overlaps? Rituals? What do you make of all of this? Hmm. The killers are usually the ones performing the ritual, not the detective. Acting out their sick fantasy. They may be trying to get you involved, forcing you into their twisted world. But with dead men coming alive, the word ritual starts to have more weight behind it. We need to look around. Learn How can we? Everything's is. flooded. We've seen this symbol before. Hmm. Good eye. Bare feet. Nightingale. Hey, it's all like, I'll see where uh... This footprints lead. Can you come through the crime scene one more time, KC? Just in case. On it. You know, there like blurry up, looking. I don't want to, I don't want to go back here. I feel like this is a bad idea. Are we sure about this? The tracks lead into the water. Where'd you go from here? Ah! I can feel something. A presence. Nightingale isn't far. Oh, good. Ammo. Nightingale. <sighs> Nightingale. Oh, 
Where are you? Witch's Ladle? There's no mystery in Cauldron Lake being named after its cauldron shape. And yet, there are many mysterious stories about the lake. It being a gloomy doorway to the underworld, or of a witch whose cauldron the lake really was. The legend tells that when the affections of a local sheriff went unanswered, he accused the lady in question of having bewitched him. She was um, swimming until she couldn't swim anymore. But her dropped ladle grew into a strange tree named Witch's Ladle. The woman returned to avenge her wrongdoers. If she was not a witch before, she was one now. She unalived the sheriff, uh, um, letting him just sink into the water in the lake. Then she took out his heart and locked it in a box. With the heart, she would summon him from the lake to exact revenge on her behalf. Or so the legend goes. That's awesome. Is that what, is that what Nightingale is? What is that? These aren't the same tracks that were here before. They're headed into the tree, not out of it. <sighs> you can toggle flashlight boost. <laughs> My flashlight burned the dark stuff away. It was covering another page. I don't like that. The I don't like close. that. Saga stepped into the witch's hut. Inside, a bright light. There were objects that stood out to Saga, as if the light had manifested them. The witch's hut. Awesome. Okay. I trust the pages to lead me to the overlap. All right. Kelsey! Glist. Okay, wait, we have stuff here. Triangle carving on the table where Nightingale was found. There we go, symbols. We got Nightingale's trail led to another page. Did we finish this? We finished this one. Okay. A bright light, nothing could hurt her. Here, there were objects that stood out to Saga as if the light had manifested them. <clears throat> the witch's hut. The fuse was in place. She had found it among the junk in the forest. Savannah, thank you for sending a sub. Safe, but for something more to be revealed as well. Thank you, Savannah. Footprints leading into the forest. Okay, then we have lunchbox. Where did we find this one? Mm -hmm. Oh, there I guess. Mm -hmm. Wow! Manuel, thank you for the five subs. Thank you so much, Manuel. That is so sweet. Boop. I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful day. I think we did all those. 
Manuscript pages. I don't want to read them. Profiling? We can profile. Nightingale. The overlap. I know Nightingale is somewhere around Cauldron Lake. The tree was a threshold. This place and the dark place. <laughs> You're in over your head. Next stop, Caldera Street Station. The threshold, like a doorway. Where? To Nightingale. It's somehow connected to a tree, which is ladle. Just an OG saying hi. Hello. I know you've been around for forever. You might be our longest standing sub. What is the game? It is Alan Wake 2. Alan Wake 2. Can I upgrade this yet? I need 12. I only have three. I need to find the witch's hut. You guys remember how to get to the witch's hut? I'm here. If I, get, if I go straight, turn to the right, and then turn left. Why is TikTok giving you green gems? What are green gems? What does that mean? Is that a new one? Andrew, thank you for the sub. Welcome to the Bambali. Oh, we're in a wave now. All right, we've got 14 minutes to get 12 more subs. Y'all know what to do. This is the witch's hut. Anderson, I thought I saw something in the woods. Probably just a deer, but I'm going to check it out. Okay. I found another page. Following Are we sure he should go check it out? Checking in. Roger. The page described the hut being lit and mentioned a fuse. Whole life, thank you for the five subs. Oh my gosh. Manuel, thank you for another five subs. Oh, you don't have to do that. Thank you guys. Boop. Boop. Thank you. If you just got a sub, shout it out. Thank you guys so much. Do I know where Christian is? Maybe the hut? I don't know where Christian is. He might be in hiding under the hut. Do I have to find a fuse? You want to play this game? I would recommend it, dude. This is good. This is really good. It says something about a fuse, I think. And it... Oh, wait, wait. Here. The fuse box is missing a fuse. Of course. I need to find one to turn on the lights. Locate a fuse in the immediate area. Oh, I don't know. Fuse. Of course we're missing a fuse. Valerie! Glist! I feel like it would be in like a box. It wouldn't just be out in the rain. Right? Would it be in the hut? There was a page? We don't have pages like that. Wouldn't it be inside the hut? 
Wait, that's the sign. We've already read that sign. That's just the sign. Find a fuse in the immediate area. Maybe, maybe by the, over here. This fuse is busted. Yes! Oh, no, it's busted. Okay, okay. What was that? Fuse? This one looks good. People should really stop littering, though. That's, you know, that's somewhat, that's, that's not our mission right now, you know? The name of the game is Alan Wake 2. If you haven't followed, hit that follow button. I'm solving a mystery. We're looking for Nightingale. <gasps> a coffee thermos. You say, I, I saved. Wait, does it not save automatically, just at places? Another page. Making progress. The image of the witch in the sign. Saga addressed the witch. The smudged line on the heart. The second part recited from memory. I brought you the heart, witch. Show me the terror. Saga pushed the heart through the hole in the sign. Interpret the page's meaning. Casey's favorite brand. Tastes terrible. Why is that here? My first ever prank on Casey. A true classic. Are me and Casey like really good friends? What if Alan is behind all of this? Okay, the case board, maybe? Nightingale is inside the overlap. Witch's ladle tree is doorway. Ritual, ritual required. Cauldron Lake, witch's hut. The page from the witch's hut seems to be describing some kind of ritual. Okay. Witch's ladle towering over Saga, watching her and the witch. Nightingale's heart, a cold, unalive lump in her hand. Nightingale's heart disappeared from the morgue. Where is it now? She squinted to read the smudged line in the heart. The second part recited from memory. I brought you the heart, witch. Show me the terror. I don't want to see it. To get into the overlap, I need to find Nightingale's heart. Read the line imprinted on it, plus the line on the page to the witch's ladle sign. Then push the heart through the hole in the sign. With the face? Wait, the hole in the sign where we read about the witch's ladle? Kimberly, thank you for sending a sub. Boop. Thank you. Give witch heart, recite words, which equals witch's ladle, sign, 
Where is her words illegible? All makes sense. Kimberly, thank you for sending another sub and finishing our sub wave. Let's go. Boop. Thank you. If you got a sub, congratulations. Skiggles, thank you for the hanging gas lights. Should I leave? Icons on the bottom left corner indicate that critical content is available in the mind place. Okay, critical content is available. Is it the TV? Profiling. We can profile. All right, the heart. The heart. Tammy, the list. I need Nightingale's heart to get to the overlap. Where is it? Just a wind close. He was there, but he was risen. Nightingale was there. The opposite of sunspots. Who said that? That's not it. I don't have what I need to find Nightingale's heart. There must be more. That's so creepy. Kate! Glist! Nightingale's heart. Where is it? While they played cards in the general store, the witch had stolen his heart. Get out of my house. Nightingale's heart is at the general store, in a fridge. Hey, we were in there. We were in there. Ducky, thank you for the duck. <laughs> thank you. Oh, we have the adventure tour TV. Okay, we got that. All right, let's get out of here. I need to check the general store for the heart. Casey, I'm headed to the general store. I think I know how to get into the overlap. Uh, Roger that. I followed some ATV tracks in the woods and got a bit turned around. Did you get lost? I've only been lost once in my life, Anderson. The years I spent with my ex-wife. I'll find my way back, don't you worry about it. LP, Glist. We're five francs away from finishing our Glist. We gotta head to the general store. I think we just follow this. This way? Okay. We follow this this way. It takes us somewhere. We get the heart. And everything will be fine. Trina, Glist. Okay, we go straight. Then we'll be at the store. We turn left, go straight, turn left. What was that? Y'all, I think something's in the store. Fine. It's just a deer.
I feel really great about this. Can I have some more stuff? Some like new things? Can I have this? Oh, we need. Okay, check with who? Lady Fortuna for at the counter. Okay, we need some sort of code. I could really use some more of those. Is it beating? I don't know. I don't know. Should we check at the counter before we activate this thing? Because I don't know if someone's going to come after us. I... Is there a code over here somewhere? What's that say? 705-713-717-7. Don't forget, update code. Is it one of these or is this like a pattern? Black Demise, thank you for the sub. Welcome to the family. Wait, what does this say? Palm reading and crystal ball gazing. All right, I'm gonna try to open it. Y'all got the numbers, right? Well, it says seven, two, three already on it. So seven, oh, five. Seven one three. Okay, well, it clearly starts with a seven. Two. Thank you, Kimberly. Would it be nine? to eight. Eight, four, six. No. Hmm. Seven, five, eight. Why was it seven, three, nine? Zero, one, two, three. Well, the next one, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I get the nine, I get the seven, and I guess I get the three? Sort of a pattern, I guess. All 
All right, and quick slot stuff in their inventory. Let's quick slot it, yeah. And let's quick slot this. Yeah. Oh. on the heart is clearer now. Okay. Legible. I feel like I recognize this. Angie! The fridge. Glist! The heart. I knew it would be here. Like I saw it in a dream. Is it beating? And now I need to give the heart to the witch. Makes total sense. I don't want to give the heart to the witch. Are we just holding it? Is it in our pocket? Angie! There are cultists in the area. They're taken, like Nightingale. Quadruple glass! yourself out there. Yeah, thanks for the heads up. I'm still finding my way back. You have the worst sense of direction. <laughs> Any city in America I can get through drunk and blindfolded. It's these damn trees. Okay, okay. I'm There's on route to Witch's Ladle. I need to perform a ritual to open the overlap. This case just keeps getting weirder, but it is exciting. All right, we're gonna do some Lucy the Llamas. Lucy the Llamas. Is it ritual time? All right, we're no longer looking for rank eight. Our next one is rank nine. Skiggles! Angie! Thank you. Did something happen to Alan? Um. Well, the thing is. We're not in the first one anymore. Alan's writing a book. It's fine. Yeah. Flaming! Yeehaw! Whole life! Thank you. Wait, how do we find, where's the sign at? This is the cabin. Which is sign? Okay. We, if we go left, we get down to the sign. Okay, just stay. Oh, here's the footsteps. Layla! <laughs> Thank you! Light the black flame candle. Should we save? I mean... Okay, well now you're having me question 